So I take care of all patients with, you know, conditions um, that require pediatric neurosurgical intervention. Um, this can range from congenital anomalies, um, abnormalities that occur during the development of, of children, um, to things like brain tumors or abnormalities of the spinal cord, all the way to patients who suffer problems from trauma and or accidents. We have some hallmark surgeries that have been done at the KHAB Nani Children's Hospital and Pediatric Neurosurgery that have been done on some of the youngest patients or that have been done for the first time. Our most advanced program, um, meaning our most established program in pediatric neurosurgery is the craniofacial program. And in that program, we're now getting to the point to where we're starting to work on um, clinical trials for some of the um, surgical techniques that we're pioneering in that program. It's the only accredited craniofacial program um, in the region. And it is a multidisciplinary clinic and program that um, is headed by a pediatric neurosurgeon and a craniofacial plastic surgeon but we also have other physicians such as ENT surgeons, speech and swallow therapists, social workers, um, neuropsychologists, that all orthodontists that all contribute um, to these patients. And it allows us to take care of patients with some of the most complex congenital anomalies of the brain, the face, and where the brain and face meet. And we've done some outstanding cases. We have outstanding outcomes. And it's great that we can offer this service to our patients in our community because then it allows patients to be taken care of and allows them to benefit from the fact that they have doctors that are local that they can reach out to. One of the reasons why I went into neurosurgery is because there is so much that's unknown about the brain and about pathology of the brain. You know, we're taking technologies now that have been developed in telecommunications and electronics and computer science, and we're applying them to medicine and we're applying them to neurosurgery and pediatric neurosurgery specifically. So I think the future is bright um, for our ability to advance care for patients in a minimally invasive manner and prolong um, the life expectancy or the quality of life for patients um, utilizing this technology. So I, I love the emergence of um, technology in the medicine and specifically in the neurosurgery.